If we think about Formula One, you, you see how much over the last 20 years the wings have uh, changed. You know, they were very simple in the, in the early 90s. The same effect happens in, in rallying. And nowadays you have even little, uh, little wings on top of the wing and really round and modified. The effect from the rear spoiler starts from 60 km per hour and up from that. Imagine now that uh, when the car goes fast and the airflow comes, you have the rear spoiler, it was pushing the, the rear down. And when it pushing the rear down and you enter the corner, the car is more stable. It won't do this kind of movement so much. So this is always the movement. This kind of movement is always bad because in the fast roads, you start to hesitate because it feels like uh, the car won't be stable and then you lift. So you want to have a car which is stable and does small movements. So the airflow for the rear spoiler does that. But that's why it's only not the rear, because you need to keep the front down. If the rear is down and front up, it's like a boat, and then it's not gonna turn to the corner. So that's why the front bumper is modified. You have a bit like um, the front splitter, and when the air comes, pushing to the, to the splitter, then there's the modification on the, on the side of the bumper that keeps both same time front and, uh, and the rear down. When you enter to the corner, when it starts to turn, it doesn't move. On the straight line, the maximum speed is pretty much the same. You have more aero, you have more track, but okay, we compensate it with the power. But the biggest difference comes to the corners. With all World Rally Car 2016 model, you came to the fast right-hand corner with Titans, you might lose the rear and you come a bit oversteering. When you go with this 17-spec car, you come and you come really fast right-hand corner, it just turns and, and keeps the one line all the time. Watch the most spectacular moments from every rally. Get WRC Plus with all rally highlights now.